Hello! In this video, we'll show you how to connect your RS2000 to the TV. In the box you'll find the wireless headset, the manual, the sound cable, the power supply and the base station. First connect power and charge the wireless receiver for about 3 hours. When you unpack it, it's not yet fully charged. Now connect sound. The blue jack goes into the blue socket and add your television into the headphone output. Just plug it in and turn your TV's volume up to about 90% and you're ready to go. However, if your television's loudspeakers have now muted and you're watching TV with other people, you might have to connect your RS2000 differently. So if your television set doesn't provide the possibility to have the sound over its loudspeakers and the headphone output simultaneously, there's the possibility to connect over SCART and RCA. You can find these adapters in most electronic retailers. Just connect the cable to the adapter and at your television's connectivity panel, make sure to take the right port. It will either say audio output or you find a symbol beside it that looks like a rectangle or a circle with an arrow pointing out of it. That's the right one. Lastly, refer to your TV's manual to see if any other steps are necessary. Connect over RCA or SCART and your TV's loudspeakers will remain working. The headphone automatically turns on when you use it and off again when you put it down. On the front side of the headphone, you find the volume and left and right are the balance buttons if you prefer to have one side louder than the other. The RS2000 offers you about 50 meters or 160 feet of range and up to 9 hours battery. Now, you can enjoy your favorite TV programs all over again.